Y'all, imagine my disappointment when I was thinking it was Friday and I just realized it's only Wednesday. Nonetheless, I'm feeling good, feeling great, so I'm going to keep the momentum up. Today, I've teamed up with my first wig, and you guys already know this is the most luxurious quality wigs on the market. They sent over this beautiful highlight brown side part bob glueless human hair wig. I'm going to show you guys how I install her for beginners. I'm even going to give you a little half up, half down action towards the end, so if you want to see how I got this look straight out of the box literally in just a few minutes keep on watching jumping right into it me and my bob were in a great mood today I'm rocking my lululemon define jacket I'm not quite sure if they are canceled or not y'all let me know in the comments down below if I should be wearing this or not anyways this is our gorgeous girl straight out of the box we're going side part today we're going for a little bit of brown highlight today we're going with my first wig which is super fire i'm super excited because i know the wig is gonna hit look at that pre-plugged hairline look at the pre-cut lace look at just look at the gorgeousness everything about this one is going to be amazing and i already know because the name my first wig speaks for itself this is the wig straight out of the box as well as the inside construction of the cap made to perfection they even did the pre-cut lace along the nape with a little bit of jagged cut they also give you the adjustable elastic band which says my first wig and again let me just show you guys how beautiful that hairline is pre-cut lace pre-bleached knots pre-plucked and so much more so this is what she looks like on and I already know all I'm gonna have to do is literally brush this one out and I could walk out the door if it was time to go pick up the kids and run errands I could really just pull this off who you know could serve you a wig and you can just brush and go I'll wait but you guys already know me I'm not gonna stop there I'm just gonna go ahead and give you guys a nice quick slay so for starters in order to slay the foundation of your wig is your real hair you're gonna have to make sure that everything underneath is taken care of correctly for the wig to look good so so here I'm just doing a little bit of edge control to tame those sideburns pushing them back so that my lace can lay flat and flush and if I choose to cut off the ear tabs the lace will blend in with my real hair and you guys can see I did decide to cut off a little bit just to make the wig hug my ear really nicely I am gonna go ahead and cut them ear tabs off in just a moment but a lot of the times I like to leave them on so I can see and imagine it and then decide if I want to keep them or not and today I decided to take them off so on this side I'm going ahead and doing the same step of just doing a little edge control and look how that bedak beauty edge control really makes them edges real sleek so here I'm just cutting off off that ear tab I decided to cut it off solely because I like my wig to fit glueless and sometimes when you leave that extra hair ear tab you will have to bond that down so the rest of the wig will be glueless but the ear tab you'll have to bond down and if you guys see when I cut that off instantly a glueless wig so now I'm just going to go in and show you guys a little bit more parting options again this is a side part bob but of course it's a lace frontal wig so you'll be able to switch up the parting as you please I like that curved parting so I'm I'm gonna leave it like that and I'm gonna go ahead and just do a quick blowout I have rediscovered the Dyson Airwrap this was my girl like circa 2019 2020 I used her literally every single day and then she got put on the shelf and she got put on the shelf because I thought she was broken for some reason she stopped working but I pulled her out and it turned on so I am using this and it kind of gives you like that nice blowout look that I love so much I need to find the rest of my attachments attachments so that I can play with it and do different styles but today I was just seeing what it would do of course I want the ends to be a little bit more bumped for my bob so I'm gonna go with a flat iron later I just wanted to see you know see what it can do now that I'm done playing let's go ahead and do the dynamic duo you guys already know this step is key it's the wax stick paired with the electric hot comb and this is gonna give you a good foundation so for me if my hairline is laid and my parting is snatched everything else as far as the length of the hair can can do whatever it wants I still will feel like that girl so by doing this step it definitely allows me the ability to make sure that my lace is super duper flat up top it's not giving helmet head or you know your auntie's church wig and it gives like sleek salon quality finish no flyaways no you know no craziness nice and shiny and super smooth now when it comes to that other part if you want to have a bang or if you want to have a little bit of volume you definitely don't have to press this down and make it flat typically I prefer my wigs to look flat up top just always but if you want that nice big blowout look you definitely can smooth over the top but really keep that body there just be sh mindful of you know what you want as you are styling your wig now that we got that out of the way I did 
decide to go back in and cut off the rest of those ear tabs if you notice how flat the wig looks it literally looks like the wig is already installed except those ear tabs are literally just sticking up and that's just i don't know if it's the shape of my head but i always want to cut the ear tabs off and if you can see it definitely blends already so i'm showing you here that i'm not going to add any spray i'm literally just going to add my lace tint my lace tint of choice is a contour shade for me so i highly recommend finding a product that is cool tone um and then that also is a little bit darker than your skin because i personally find that when i use a product that is my skin tone in real light it'll give like a white cast or flashback or sometimes it'll even be too red whereas a cool tone contour powder will go in and make it look perfect so at this point we are pretty much done all i have to do is go in and bump the ends for that nice you know that nice fire bust down bob look that i love so much and i'm just using a baby list flat iron because of course my baby list pro went to heaven on me i don't know why but i guess i use that one so much too that it's time for an upgrade in all of my styling tools i've been using the same ones because i love them and they work so well so i haven't went and replaced my baby list pro because i definitely want to try a new flat iron if you have a suggestion i think i'm gonna go with fhi for my next flat iron um but if you have a suggestion or maybe even t3 but if you have a suggestion for a flat iron you love leave it in the comments so that i can purchase because i like this regular baby list but it doesn't allow me to curl like i like i like the baby list because it allowed me to curl and straighten my hair also don't forget the back when you're bumping your hair whenever you're doing your hair never ever forget the back always show the back some love because that is what people see and literally so many times i've seen girls out and be like oh she definitely forgot the back she definitely skipped that step this for me was enough it gave nice and sleek but i felt like i can add a little bit of oomph so i was just kind of debating what i would do and of course i went with that dyson air wrap now i think you guys have seen me use the air wrap this part of it, the curler once on my channel maybe last week this is what it looks like at this point and i was deciding if i want to bring that and this here blew me away i think this was my second time using this and i just was blown away at the fact that this is a blow dryer but it can do a full-on defined curl so with this i'm still trying to get used to it maybe i can watch a tutorial because it's almost like sometimes you'll put the hair against it and it won't grip it and then sometimes you will and it'll grip it so good so i'm trying to figure out what is the angle maybe sometimes i'm using too much hair either way i love how this gives a beautiful curl like especially thinking about my girls when they get a little bit older and they're ready to start like doing their hair themselves i would for sure introduce them to a product like this when it comes to like straightening their hair and styling their hair to prevent them from using like flat irons and putting too much heat and you know the whole heat damage thing i love this imagine going around the entire head and doing these type of curls i'm gonna brush it out so i'm not gonna keep this super definition but i did want that body and i love the way this did its thing Okay, so now I'm done with that. And again, I didn't necessarily want it to be super duper um, defined. I just wanted to have that. This here would be so, 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 so cute. That bob you know body and i think that did a great job that opposite side the bang side i definitely need work on that side but the other side i love so much now i'm gonna go ahead and just tint the lace really quickly and i'm just using the Babylon fit me powder definitely using a powder a different powder in the parting than i did in the hairline definitely works best for me and that was pretty much the look okay so i want to switch my top so that you can for sure get the look really good i really love this bob it's super simple easy definitely like a vegas wig i love this one for like a weekend out of town super simple and easy to install fits glueless you can bond it down and you can do the pretty little baby doll half up half down simple easy fun flirty here is another look at that hairline before we go i wanted to show you guys that scallop zigzag cut along the hairline the pre-cut lace is absolutely top tier and here is the packaging that they provided they did give me this dust bag they also gave the pop out wig stand as well well as these beautiful brown wig caps here is the specs on my wig as well as a magazine if you want to slow that down of course all of the details are mine are in the description box as well and then of course they included this reusable pouch and inside they did give me two alligator clips as well as a rat tail comb that of course has their logo on it super super nice and a great attention to detail and that is pretty much it my loves this was literally the most simple easy tutorial ever the most beginner 
beginner of beginner friendly girls can follow this and get it right even if you are like trying to look out for like your parents and your elders like your mother your grandmother this is a great wig for the older ladies too especially if they want to add a little color you can also get a wig like this with a more natural color as well and they would be able to install the wig on their own so your mama your auntie your nana if they need a new church wig this is amazing if you need a vacation wig this is amazing an everyday wig this one literally serves all purpose and i love her so much so of course check her out in the description box thank you guys so much for watching don't forget to subscribe like this video and share with your friends and as always i'll see you in the next one smooches